the angel of the Lord came and sat down under the oak in Ophrah that belonged to Joash the Abizrite, where his son Gideon was threshing wheat in a winepress to keep it from the Midianites. When the angel of the Lord appeared to Gideon, he said, The Lord is with you, mighty warrior. Pardon me, my lord, Gideon replied. But if the Lord is with us, why has all this happened to us? Where are all his wonders that our ancestors told us about when they said, Did not the Lord bring us up out of Egypt? But now the Lord has abandoned us and given us into the hand of Midian. The Lord turned to him and said, Go in the strength you have and save Israel out of Midian's hand. Am I not sending you? Pardon me, my lord, Gideon replied. But how can I save Israel? My clan is the weakest in Manasseh, and I am the least in my family. The Lord answered, I will be with you, and you will strike down all the Midianites, leaving none alive. Welcome back to Network Disciple Church. Sometimes life doesn't go as planned you made. In the Bible, there is a story about a guy named Gideon. Not only was Gideon from the weakness clan in the tribe of Manash, but also he was the wicked person in his family. He was definitely an unlikely person for God to choose. Later, God leads Gideon into battle against the Midian Thais, an enemy tribal with 38,000 men. Then God tells Gideon he has too many warriors. And if they defend them Midian times, it will look like they did it by themselves. So Gideon sent 20,000 men home. God said that is still too many. So eventually, Gideon is left with only 300 men. The Lord gives Gideon and Israel victory over the Midian times with only the 300 soldiers which clearly wasn't what Gideon had ordinarily planned. When we think about the future and what God has in store for us, it's important to remember that things won't always go as we plan them. In fact, there are three unwritten rules of plans you should follow. First, Plan to start over. Life is a series of starting over. As soon as you get middle school down, it's time to start high school. Right. When you think you, you haven't gotten the ins and outs of a high school need, it's time to start preparing for college and being real adults. The truth is, it never ends. Learn to start over. When plans change, roll with it. You never know what God might be off to. Embrace the quality season you are in. Second, plan to say no. Sometimes we have to say no to good things in order to say yes to the best things. We can't do everything. Pray for wisdom to know where you should invest your time to have the biggest impact for God's kingdom. Last one, third, plan to be creative. God's plans can sometimes take us down the path we don't expect. For Gideon, good example, this involved using what he had clay jars with touch instead of normal battle ready weapons. Use the gifts that God has given you today. Don't worry about what other people have. Recognize that what God has given you with His help goes further than you can imagine. Thank you for watching this video. See you next time.